Hi one and all, welcome to Missing People's Psychic Readings. I'm Margaret. If you like this graph, then put your thumbs up if you want. So this is Harley and she's 39 years old. She was living in Los Angeles. Kind of what I kind of get it. And uh, what happened on October the 17th um, this year, 2001, um, she went to her son's football game. I think it's a football game um her husband seen, saw her there i don't know if she was meant to go and pick him up or went to see the football game i'm not quite sure but her ex-husband saw her there so she got there um after that they don't know what happened to her um the police got information on the cct camera at harley's house that she was with her dog um yeah and her dog was found at a hotel downtown in Los Angeles. I put the name down. I do have this place here, so I'll put the name down for you. But um, the dog was found there. Um, and they say she was she's been there once before, but before that, nothing else. Um, so that's the information I got with Heidi. I don't get a, I don't get a lot because I. Try not to get too much because when I do readings, it doesn't help with this. So I'm going to do a reading for her. Feel free to move on if you don't want to watch it, okay? Two, if you have any information on her, please pass it on to the police. Thirdly, if you find any of my information useful, feel free to pass it on to the police. I'm here in Australia. I can't pass things on in America. So if you have information and you find mine information, useful to to pass it on um yeah that's pretty much it so this is what i'm getting with harley now the hotel which she left her well her dog was seen i've been told that she's been there more than once um the police say she's been well people say she's only been there once and i'm hearing that she's been there more than once okay two with the dog i'm been i'm been hearing she had to leave the dog there, um, so she's the one that left it there. Don't know why, but she had to leave the dog there. Um, and I'm picking up that I don't know why. I'm wondering if this is um, a proof of evidence or something. I'm getting cancer, just the word cancer. I don't know if she, if she had cancer or it's her birth um, sign or not, but I'm getting the birth cancer okay secondly what i'm getting now i don't know if this is at the hotel that she her dog was found on that but i'm getting like a um a room done like a basement what i would say a basement with a window it's quite dark and i'm hearing that she's there now i don't like i said i don't know if it's at the apartment because it can be a, a apartment place or at a, a place where you have offices and that because it feels like that um, i'm not seeing what's there but i do feel like it's more like an apartment or an office place okay and it's got level of um levels there, there okay so it's not this one levels but two or three levels and maybe more that's what i'm picking up on um what I'm seeing, uh, this is read, so you can question this. I'm, I'm, I would say you can question this because I'm getting she's safe, but then at the same time, I'm getting she's past. So, yeah, it's quite read. I've got that quite read. So, I don't know what it is, but I'm just saying, hearing she's safe, but then I'm hearing that she's past. So, yeah, it's quite a read thing. I, I find that really read actually. Now, I'm hearing. The police do know something, um, but they're not putting it out there because it helps with the case. Um, uh, it's almost like it will link into something that someone will say, okay? It won't be exactly what the, the police have, but the, someone will say something and it will link into that thing, okay? Now, what I'm getting to is someone out there is around, knows... Um, um, Heidi, um, I don't know if it's a relative or a friend or not, but someone around her knows something.
said, okay, that's what I'm hearing, that someone about knows her, around her, knows something. Um, and it's, the know it, but it's not like, I forgot to tell the police this and that, but I feel like it's more, they know something, okay. Um, and before you all go out and say, did it, was it the husband? I really don't know if it was the husband. I don't know if it's the son, I don't know, but um, he, someone knows something related to Heidi's disappearance, okay. Um, well, that's the again. Um, now, I don't know, I'm getting downtown. I don't know if it's downtown Los Angeles or another place, but I am getting downtown, okay? Yeah, um, the Duce department is downtown, so it might be connected to that, okay? Um, yeah, I think that was it. Um, Yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, and I'm just gonna leave it at that because that's all I got. So this is Heidi. She's 39 and she went missing. Um, and she, yeah, um, no one knows what happened to her. She, she was last seen at a football ground place where her son was playing football. Um, and her ex husband saw her. Um, that's pretty much it. Um, I'm. That's all I can pass on to you. But I find the reading to really interesting because um this when I hear she's safe, the next minute she's passed. So there's something in that, okay? I don't know what it is, but there's something in that. And like I said, cancer, I don't know if it's more that that she is she has cancer or is that her birthstone. Um I do pick up I this this sort of the Something old is coming up, so something's happened in the past, it's going to come up to help with the case, okay. I just picked that up then. So there's something in the old times that happened with her, it's going to come up, okay. But that's pretty much it. Um, I hope you like it. Subscribe if you want. Um, you can question certain things and it's like, why am I getting that she's passed and that she's safe? I don't get that. There's something in that, okay. Um, yeah, so like I said, subscribe if you want, put your thumbs up if you want, and I'll see you next time for another missing person. Bye.